You know, I talk a lot about overgrown weeds during the summer, and with all the rain we've seen, some homeowners are letting the weeds grow out of control. You know who you are out there. You only have a few <laughs> days to get it under control before city workers come knocking. Cam Max Nicolette Perdomo here now to talk about those potential violations. Lauren Bryan, codes enforcement officers will hit neighborhoods next week looking for tall weeds and grass and other violations around your home. On Tuesday, code enforcement officers are heading out to check for tall weeds in your yard and around your home. We've taken this opportunity to utilize one of our code enforcement exercises to focus on weeds. Uh, with the you know recent rains, it's really greened up our yards, but it's really brought the weeds out too. Get your yard sick out. If it's taller than a certain amount, you could get a fine. Any uncultivated vegetation over eight inches tall over a majority of the property is a violation. Your property includes your alley and not just behind your fence, but the middle of the alley too. If the city has to come out and do it for you, you'll face an even bigger fine. We utilize private contractors in this department to go out and mow those weeds. Uh, then the property owners billed for the cost of the mowing plus a $150 administration fee. Walker says the weed ordinance is in place to keep not just your yard but entire neighborhood looking beautiful. And not mowing your lawn could be dangerous. Tall grass and weeds not only once it dies and dries out becomes a fire hazard, uh, the, they also provide habitat for insects and vermin, which could be vectors for disease. If you notice a weed violation and want the city to go check it out, just call them the hotline. That number is on the bottom of your screen. You can also find more information about what to do on our website, everythinglubbock.com. People have to get, get a lot of